All right, today we are working out with my buddy Brian Gans. He is at the front door, so we're gonna go get him, and we're just gonna go ahead and start it. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> wait, wait, sorry. Oh, dogs. <laughs> That's the one you're fostering? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh my god. Ah. <laughs> it's okay. Ah. <laughs> it's a bitch. Dude, I've never heard of this. Ah. It's okay. Yeah, just... Oh yeah, so we're, we're vlogging today. Let's get it. That's your brand, isn't it? It is, it's me and my buddies, yeah. Uh, nice look though, definitely not the fittest, but. Not the fittest. That's okay. DJ, you wanna work out with us? Just a couple of dogs. Oh. Marquette, let's go. Brian's picking up the old warm up habits of uh, playing basketball and tormenting the dogs. <laughs> All right, Rocky. All right, so DJ's off with uh, Rocky running. Two birds with one stone. Now he doesn't have to walk Rocky anymore. All right, I'll take it. Let's get it. Oh, yeah, that was pretty rough. All right, don't, don't. Okay, fine. We'll go, we'll go righty this time. Go righty. Get in there. Oh. Yep, gets it to fall. So to start the workout, we're gonna do some front squats, superset it with some, uh, uh, get yeah, yeah, tur Turkish get-ups. Kettlebell, no, not Turkish get-ups. What are they called? It's Turkish get-ups, yeah, yeah, it's Turkish get-ups. That, and then we're gonna uh, do a workout that Brian's gonna m be the mastermind behind. But yeah, first front squats and goblet, front squats and uh, Turkish get-ups. I don't know why it's such a struggle. <laughs> That's a dope sticker. Thank you. I was originally trying to get 18 in this morning. Brian started the Turkish get up at, what, 60 something pounds? Yeah, 20 kilos. We have one at work in the room and it's like a 108 and I, I do that. You do 108 pound, holy shit. <laughs> what? Max what? My max Turkish get up is probably like 60 pounds. Too. All right, 62 pounds or 60 something pounds. Get up. I always, there's always an awkward moment of Turkish get ups where I don't really remember what I'm doing. Right foot? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh god, I'm like stuck. Yeah. Okay. That transition from when you're overhead to reverse lunge, take this foot and swivel it out. Because now what that's going to do is when you hinge in that half kneeling position, yeah. it creates more space for the leg to sweep through. And you want to sweep through on the lateral outside edge instead of trying to drag like your toes through. That's where I got stuck. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So it's kind of that. Yeah. I see what you're saying. Now you gotta do the other arm. Up it up. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hold up. Hammer. Hammer. So put your right forearm in the floor. Yeah, roll onto that right forearm. Kind of sideways. Yeah, there you go. Next up, next through. Right, so this is what you were saying. Yeah, there you go. And now drag the sort of pinky toe. Yeah. Oh, that's magical. There you go. Yeah. He's just coming to hang. Yeah, I, I do. Yeah, I, I, I drink my coffee and I admire my lawn. That's, sick. That's bad goals for sure. Yeah. I admire my landscaping. Yeah. Well, actually, Lauren did the garden, so I can't take credit for that. 6 a.m., fire up the lawnmower. Oh, I'm definitely not 6 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> if it say like 9 or 10 a.m., yeah, I'm out of here. I did wake up early this week to golf, but that's different. That's, who does that's that? wrong, yeah, I don't want to be right. <laughs> yeah. We're talking about DJ's immense pride in the lawn. That's like me with my mustache. You just, sometimes you just gotta admire your work. All right, <laughs> first set, 275 for eight. That is some serious depth. Woo! Definitely no lack on the depth. No. I ate oatmeal a little recently. <laughs> a little recent.
Dodging shrapnel. Well, <laughs> while Brian was doing his uh, front squats, DJ was cutting with the weed whacker and he was launching these wood chips at Brian. Gotta be ready for the unknown. You never know. You got a front squat in the middle of a tan bark storm. <laughs> we got a Metcon coming. Brian's in charge of that. I was telling him my engine's absolute trash right now. He looks like an engine fiend. I think we're doing partner workout. Is that right, partner? Yeah. Sounds good. We're gonna we're gonna have Brian real quick explain the. Uh, Hold on, let me, let me let me get it. Let me finalize it in the old melon. He, he has no idea what we're doing either. So that's good. So we did 200 calories. We got we got. A no, no, this will be the mock run. All right. All right, Brian did his dry run of the workout. Now we're gonna listen to the coach. It's gonna be 20 rounds, 10 each, 15 cal assault bike, three power snatch, three overhead squat, three bar muscle up at 135, 155. What's what did it? What was uh, it? 155. 155. 155. Or I'm sorry, you can full squat the third snatch. Okay, and that would count, that as, would one count as one and one overhead. Probably the first five rounds will be a healthy push. Second five uh, rounds will be a uh, hang on, it's almost over. <laughs> All right, so yeah, we can get that ready. There's always just so many back and forth. DJ hates it. I fucking hate it. <laughs> there we go. Oh, this is awkward. Wait. So we'll just cross this out. Are you looking to like hit a certain RPM on no. this? Or? Two more rounds. I'm painting. Brian's cruising. I saw this coming. I saw this coming. Brian's finishing it up.
There we go. Yeah. All right, let's get some half decent lighting here. All right, that's good enough. All right, if you've been watching these vlogs long enough, you, do, you know we do some post game analysis after some good workouts, especially partner workouts. We're gonna get some post game for Brian. This is the first time we're actually getting post game from Brian, so this is a good one. Peeping the shirt real fist. <laughs> Not the fittest. Good post game and then give a breakdown of nice cow. No, actually, uh, the workout was good. I'm glad we did the 10 rounds, 10 rounds each, 20 total. Uh, the first four or five rounds were the slowest. Yeah. And then it kind of started to pick up, but I was trying to keep an eye on my pace, the RPMs on the bike, about 74, 76, done in 45, 46 seconds, and then singles, power snatch, keep the transitions kind of relatively fast. Took a peek at the clock, I was averaging like two-ish minutes, maybe just a little less, a little over, but uh, yeah, you were you were hanging on. Yeah, I was hanging on for dear life. I <laughs> right, well, now you I know was, how I feel on the front squats. Uh, yeah, so. if, like, if he's not the fittest, I'm like dead last. <laughs> I don't know what that would be. Uh, yeah, nice lift co. Uh, go ahead, check us out at Nice Lift Co on Instagram. Uh, I'll put I'll put the little Instagram tag yeah, right here. Yeah, and probably say tag. like at Nice Lift Co. Yeah, just a few dudes uh, that like to hang out and work out. Inspecting the long yet again, giving us a wave. Well, making sure Reggie didn't poop somewhere, and I step in it later. Oh yeah, he's inspecting. You don't want the lawnmower to hit some poop. No landmines. All right, there's your post game, from Brian. Yeah, that's no doubt. Yeah, I was definitely. If, if if you do CrossFit and you've ever done like a partner to partner, you know someone gets buried. Barrier, <laughs> buried, buried. I don't know how, it, I got I got destroyed. But yeah, <laughs> yeah, absolutely yeah. rinsed. Yeah, exactly, yeah, exactly, best said. All right, so post, post workout now, and uh, Brian's taking me to get a nice, uh, nice sandwich. We're kind of in a feud though, because I think sandwiches are totally fine, if not better when they're warm and fresh off like a toaster, and Brian is so against that. Warm sandwiches are trash. <laughs> See? Oh, look at this cutie pie. Uh, definitely pickle on the side. Yes, sir. And well, I'm gonna get the vinegar. Yeah. Actually, I trust. I trust it. This looks real good. No. First time. Superhero? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's bomb. <laughs> That's a great sandwich. Debatably one of the best sandwiches I've ever had. Alright, sandwich real good. I gave it an 8.8. .8. I gave it an 8.8. .8. I think that is possibly like the best like classic sandwich I've had. And by classic, I just mean like me, kind of just your normal ex expectations for a sandwich. 8.8, .8. I think it's fantastic. If you live in the area, you should go. Uh, I mean, it's at least a 9.1, at least. I mean, hopping into the nines, that's a big, that's a big, uh, that's a big jump. <laughs> it's a it's, it's that good of a sandwich. <laughs> right. Greater than life. Put me in the, uh, you, you, the old dirt there. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Just leave me hanging. Sorry, right, I didn't know. My bad. <laughs> we'll line up something for Sunday and get you out there on the pickleball course. Oh, yeah. Pickleball. We're on it. All right, man. All right, see you, dude. See ya.